There will be people who are you. The people are huge. The doorkeeper. Oh, well, it's good to be back. It's good to be back. I was sitting bored there for a while. Um, as I say, I don't have to deal with this week. It's quite um, sad, actually. Um, but I have a lot to go through. But I'm back. I'm here. Live. So what you've all been up to? You've all been doing well? Been cold this week, isn't it? Really cold. Um, first of all, this is sponsored by Deputy and Hamilton. Um, Stuart Deputy and Hamilton is, is sponsored by. And second of all, Johnny Boy Steele's book, The Bird That Never Flew. Please go and check it out. Top read. And as I say, me, Donnie. Bums up. Keep it going, me man. You'll get there. And drop me sparrow. Thanks for your call it uh, your shout out, sorry. Um good man. Detective the Fed to Scotland and the house. How was your day, pal? Good evening, Dan. Gloves up, dog down. Hope it's all good. I'm all good, brother. How are you? Uh out and about again. I'm fantastic, man. Just getting on with it. Was at the dentist today to get the boat and set. All done. Um and I'm, just, I'm quite looking forward to that. So that means we'll have the top. That means we'll have the top set done. And the boat will set. I'll be getting done today. So I'll be having a warm my teeth. So thank God. I mean, but let's see. 2022 is this is my year. Um, a lot of more stuff coming on. Maybe Jolly Boy, Stuart Dempsey. We're going to do the fight to... Give me a wee Donny support, James Mitchell, the amigos, doing the support, Donny, uh, and we're doing Ben Hatcher. So things are moving up, so things are moving up, and part of the channel, I'll tell you, moving forward, and um, there'll be more, just uh, trying to so, there'll be more kind of mere feet coming through, um, uh, working with Stuart and James and the rest of us, um, it'll be mere proper kind of, what do you call it, content coming on, um, training wise, you'll be seeing but people training, hopefully, and as I say, uh, when we go down to the fight, you'll see the fight at first hand, because as I say, I'm doing there doing the camera work for the, the fight, for alone, so, it's looking good, it's looking good. Um, what fight am I looking forward to watching is um, Chaza and Ben. That's a fight I'm, I'm really what I'm really wanting really to see. And we've been built up waiting for this for a, a while, eh? Um, <laughs> Who's that? Back on day shift, mate. Brilliant now. I can settle on the couch and watch you on the telly, top man. Thanks a lot, Laura. And thanks a lot, mate. Means it a lot. Um, as I say, good to see you. You're, you're on the day shift. That's all. Maybe I actually did a couple of lives during the day then. You know what I mean? Um, I've actually been thinking about doing that, mixing up a wee bit, eh? But I'm out kind of helping people on a um, but move furniture for the local charity. So it depends what I'm doing, eh? Because I'm out and about a lot now. But I man, I would actually do a couple of lives during, during the day, during the week. Right? I thought about that, you know, thought about it. But we'll get there, then we'll get there. I'm no in any rush to get thousands of subs or thousands of likes or thousands of this or thousands of that. I'm just here to keep everybody ticked off away. And simple as that. Um, I'll be shame of that boy um, in Pullman that uh, hung himself. Um, that's quite sad, eh? When you get justice for um, the corruption that goes, in, goes on in these prisons, because that's been eight, nine, you know what I mean? See, eight overdoses and about four, four or five deaths in Scottish prisons alone. 
you know what I mean, for maybe last October. So, you know what I mean, there's a lot of things that you need to worry about with corruption in uh, Scottish prisons. See, Scotland, Scotland, Scotland's a pure corruption country. Falkirk is corrupt to the core. But by far corrupt to the core. And, but as I say, um, Scotland is full of corruption. It is full of corruption in Scotland there. Um, and this is what we need to root out, the corruption and where it's coming from. You know what I mean? And it's all right saying to people, I but this does good to the community and that does good to the community. But does it? But they're actually doing for the community. But they're putting into the community. But, but you, what can you see that they're benefiting from the community? You know what I mean? If they're shutting all these buildings down and doing all this, so they're not doing anything for the community, really. You know what I mean? So the council is just one, one big library council. Right? They'll tell you anything you want here just to shut you up. Right? But anyway, apart from that, um, it's, they're just, well, we expected to put up and do it. Right? But it's a no fair to bother you. Right? Um, so I think Mayor should be on the street and voicing their opinions about it. Because you will remember these prisoners are Crypto carrot. I right, well, yeah, the council are a joke, mate. Um, as I say, you know, the council are a pure fucking joke. Um, they'll just, they'll not get any help from them at all. I mean, they're not interested in you. All they want to do is just give you fucking a house and fucking fire you away. And even if that's it, that's if you even get a house. And the, I know a 72 year old man that we're just moving stuff on the now. He's been waiting. He's been waiting for a year for a house, you know what I mean? And that's him just got a house. And it's a shame because what you said they put up with in the last year with the council in Falkirk is unreal, you know what I mean? But anyway, forget that in a way, forget that in a way. Um, see, there's a Batman getting. Uh, formed in uh, Glasgow. We take the wee man through there, get some content through there, uh, doing the Batman movie, and see if we can see anybody. Batgirl, sorry, Batgirl. Um, see if we can see anything, there's some quite dead. You know what I mean? You, you don't get much of that up here. You, you need to go to London, Birmingham, and all that places, and that. Right? But they're up in Scotland, so why not go and try and get some footage? You know what I'm talking about? You know, you never know, you can actually meet the person. You know what I mean? There's plenty, plenty of people in the news there and met a lot of them, celebrities. So you never know your luck. That's what you've got to do. You've got, you can only go to ask. You, know, you didn't ask people right, for interviews or this or that, then you'll not get it. Right? You've got to ask. Right? And as I say, all I did is just ask. But the new, my thyroid clean up. And if people know what a thyroid is, it's a, an adrenaline gland. And as I say, um, to see if you've got or if you've got underactive or overactive, your thyroid. Eh? Means it's underactive, means that your mood goes kind of. Thanks, thanks, uh, out and about back in. I hope, I hope it is my take, but the, the things will go on the way in the next couple of months in the journey um, with the 3D Fight Club. Well, this. Should do it, eh? Um, and who's who's appearing on the show shortly? Um, is what should be doing it. But I'm always take my time, and I spoke to Stuart, I spoke to me, Johnny, and James, and that. They know, they know, they know the score. We we all know the score. There's four years, and we keep it clear. And as I say, we know the score, and but each what you know, each of them got a day. I mean, I know what my plans are. They know what my plans are, and we just butt in it a wee bit of time, you know what I mean? Because end of the day, you've got to remember, you didn't know who's watching this, these lives anyway, eh? you know what I mean? You get journalists, you get posts, you get this, you get that, so we can't afford to be talking about anything stupid, and that's how I stay out of all the, all the beef, all the grief, because at the end of the day, I'm not interested in that. I'm 40 year old, right? and I'm not here for anybody's entertainment. And, you know, I'm talking about, and it'd be, 
a limited to be putting people in rings in a BKB. People didn't actually realise the serious the seriousness of BKB in. You know what I'm talking about? So they can shout and ball all they want, but see at the end of the day, this is what you've got to understand. When you get into a when you get into a bare knuckle boxing match, right? You're coming out with broken bones. You're coming out with fucking heavy broken bones, serious injuries, and serious, serious injuries. And right, and if you can't breathe right, you're no lasting you're no lasting 30 seconds. And so what you're gonna put yourself you might put yourself in a situation where you're gonna get fucking sparkled and and but a couple of fucking a couple of fucking rapids and no I mean you can't go all the way I'll take my inhaler, you know, because that's not the way it works. So as I say, you've just got to kinda dare be silly put yourself in a situation in the first place because you can get seriously fucking up and and all these people that are on drugs and whatever they're doing, you know what I mean, shouting people out and doing this and doing that, they're all mental because they're all drinking and they're all taking drugs and they're all thinking like, you know what I mean? The fucking he man and Superman and want to do this, want to do that. It's a fucking joke. They're getting used. You know what I'm talking about? They're getting used. Right? And as I say, the only person that I, I can see doing training, right, is we do, is we Donny, we Donny, and that's because that's because my pal Stuart and James they'll pick we Donny through the through his bases. You know what I mean? And that's the only person I can see is actually putting an effort into actually wanting to do these fights is we Donny, and and that's thanks to my markers. But the rest of them, they've not even put a video up air in boxing or training, even training for the fucking box, even training for a fight. You know what I mean? I've been with you months away, but when you're no when you've not been in a ring and you've now took full blows like that and you're no training, then believe me, you're in fucking trouble. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean? Um so it's it's up to them, you know what I mean? And if they want to get in there and you punched about and got their face smashed in, eye socket burst, whatever, you name it. And you've got to remember, your 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 veins and your family's got to watch that video. And so you've got to take that above ten. I'm for I'm a 40 year old family man now. And I just turned 40 in the 14th. I'm a family man. And I do things. And right. Maybe I didn't go on about it, maybe I didn't think with that, but I do things. That's how I'm going fucking YouTube every day. And, you know what I'm talking about? Because I'm doing things now. And, and as I say, my life's gone away in a different angle. You know what I mean? I keep it the drama. And I'm not interested in the drama. Because the drama just, it's just crap. It's just bullshit. It's just your politics. And it's only there to cause trouble. And, and that's no what I'm about in it. And you know what I have been in the first place? I've just no entertaining people. That was 2021. This is 2022. This year's going to be fantastic. And me and the boys are going to fucking run rush this year and we're gonna get there and and once this fight's done with Donnie and it does his damage and the fighting throws then we'll move on to the next guy you know what I'm talking about and we'll just take it there and take it there and but as I say you know what I mean Bobby Day I don't know he could be a good fighter I don't know you know what I mean but you never ever judge a book by its cover because the boy could be a good scrapper you know what I'm talking about? Maybe just because he's full of drinking drugs. Doesn't mean to say he's not a good fighter. And because when he's in the jail and he's not drinking drugs, he's straight. You know what I mean? So he can hardly be full of and so you know, you know you know what I mean? Don't ever judge a big by his cover. And that's what I say trying to say to all my trolls. And you know what I'm talking about? Then he then he then he judge a big by his cover. And but at the end of the day, if you when you do, then it gets put on you. It's not that when you fuck, it's not that when you shit yourself. And, but, you know what I mean? All the days, all they're doing is creating me a, I'm going for my channel. And that's it, because they're not going to get a response from me. No chance. They're not going to get a response. They're not going to get an auction. So, they're wasting their time. And, um, but, aye. So, as I say, by Bobby, Bobby K. As I say, he looks game. He looks, he's right up for it. He's right up for it. I'll give him his due. But you, you know what I mean, guys? Come on. You just, 
you know what I mean, ex addicts, you know, just got to remember you're leaving, you're training, you know what I mean, you know what I'm talking about. These boys on the fucking about, these boys want to see his training, you know what I'm talking about. I want to see his training, you know what I'm talking about. Because at the end of the day, there's big money involved, you know what I mean. And if you want the big money, you need to put the effort in, you know what I'm talking about. And as I say, don't do it because you've got an event, you've got a vengeance or a date because you want to get it. You know what I mean? Date for yourself to prove to yourself you're still you still can get. I mean, don't do it to prove anybody, don't put yourself in a situation where you need to prove yourself to anybody and back yourself. You know what I mean? If you don't want to do it, then do it. Because at the end of the day, a lot of people will actually shake your hand. You know what I mean? Then letting them down. You know what I'm talking about? For some fact does. Nobody likes, it. Nobody likes to be with, with an arsehole, you know what I mean? So, my advice to people that are taking part in need this BKB is have a real hard think to yourselves about the damage it's going to happen to you. And, because then I think you're going into that ring and it's going to be, but it's like a pair of boxing gloves on, because it's fucking nothing like that. You know what I mean? It's like a spear go and a beater and it's bandaged hands up, you know what I mean? And I've been to a few of these bare knuckle things, and believe me, it's fucking nasty. It's nasty, really nasty. And, but, eh, bro, next man's only brave as the next man. And if that person's got in their head that they can do it, then let them. But you've got to remember, you know what I mean? It's not a fucking, it's not a, it's not a, a, a game like that. It's serious. And, um, but it's up to yourselves, personally. As I say, no, me, 40 to the new, and I've not been to the gym for a bit. So, about a good seven months. You know what I mean? Fair enough, fair enough a day, we bits of, like, Cadillac basketball training, CB and that, and stuff like that, but proper weights, heavy weights, I've not done that for at least Eight year, eight year I've not done that proper weights, right? And I was, but I was on steroids back then, I was, I was, I was big then, right? Um, but no, I just did kind of CV um, to kind of keep the breathing going, you know what I mean? Because I'm 40 and I've been smoking with fuck, and so I think the chest is fucked to go with hey, I don't know, and I don't know. But as I say, it's just watch what you're doing. And, and remember, the pros and journalists and whatever watch these programs and these channels, then they think they done it. Of course, the fucking day. And you know, talk about they will go to they will go to it. And you know, talk about like people that said heavy characters on their channels, right? Obviously, the post is going to watch their channel and watch who they've got on their channel. The simple fact is, they've committed crimes years ago that they maybe actually slip up and knew when they're telling their fucking thoughts. You know what I mean? So, that's how you've got to remember these people are watching. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean? So, you just go and watch what you say and don't incriminate yourself when you're on a podcast, right? So, but a lot of people carry keep on the fucking shot, and you know what I'm talking about. And the next minute, you know, it's where the fucking so where the YouTube. And the next minute, people are getting their lifted and get arrested and stuff like that. And it's all just cause one person, you know, and just open their mouth and just talk shit. And but you've got to put it in the the, the fence. How the fuck do you know what a journalist looks like? How do you know what a person looks like? And when they're, they're on a fucking phone. You know what I mean? You can't. So you just go to watch and listen to the words that they're saying. You know what I mean? And judge it by yourself and answer it correctly. And if you think it's, there's something no right about that, then you answer it. You know, just bypass the subject or to something else. You know what I mean? Because you will get people snooping on this channel and other channels trying to get information. You know what I mean? Um, they what's going on. You know what I'm talking about? And other stuff. That's going on. But they'll not get nothing because we 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 know 
what to say and when to keep a mouth shut and, and stuff like that. So, as I say, just a, a wee warning for you all now, you know what I mean? Just be careful what you're saying in your platforms because, as I say, there's boys in there, as you already know, that a journalist was on his channel and he didn't know. Poor guy, you know what I'm talking about? Um, and there was one with a Polish guy on his channel and he didn't even know. Poor guy, you know what I'm talking about? And you just don't know who you're talking to. You know what I mean? Or who's watching you, I mean. So, Ah, uh, well, out and about. Um, uh, he was 2021, pal. Um, what more can you say? You know what I mean? What more can you say? Um, he was away for Facebook. He was away for YouTube for a while there. No reason to come back and say fuck all. But he did. He came right back on. Mentioned my name straight away. God knows why. And... and I just don't know, because see, in the day, Tempe, shut your fucking mouth, seriously. I, see, it's constantly you that annoy me. You've not got a name, you've not got a face to your name. I, I'm waiting for you. You're doing my name. I, um, I, um, see that, I can't be bothered with that. Eh? So, see anybody, see anybody who's going to come on and start talking past. I start fucking, you know what I mean? Just coming out of shit, you're just getting blocked, and you're just getting fucking blocked, and because I can't evolve anyway. This is 2022, and, and as I say, if you're not going to come on and try and be reasonable, and I'm not done fuck all of you, so why have you been fucking half to me? And so I've not done nothing to any, and not one person have done anything, but these are all on my back for what? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Gotta grip yourself, man. You know what I mean? Fuck's sake. It's why I let boys be fucking boys, man. I know. Uh, exactly. That's, I think that's what I did. I, just, I didn't even entertain anyone. I mean, I just block them. Get the fuck. Better off than that, eh? But then the day, man, I'm not here to fucking listen or fucking read fucking this or read that. And silly fucking keyboard and warrior bring their fucking phones, man. Eh? There's your tits in, man, eh? Just blocks your fucking page up, man, with fucking nonsense, man. I mean, but, um, as I say, I thanks to Jokney last night for giving me a big shout out. Jokney Sparrow, my buddy, man. Um, me, Jokney used to be like, on here. All right, Ross, what's happening, bro? How you doing, pal? You keeping it real? Keeping it real, brother? Um, I, uh, the bubble jockey, he used to be a good of mine, and now he's doing better than me, the bugger, and, but he's a good guy, don't he? He's funny as fuck, eh? I mean, that's what I'm saying, if you can't laugh, and, see if you can't even laugh, laugh, see if you can't even laugh at yourself, and then, what's the point, eh? What's the point to go on YouTube if you can't laugh at yourself? I, I have a laugh with people, and I, have a, I laugh at myself, right? But see when folk come on and start, what you did, what you did, you did, that kid, and all that why are you come on fucking with a negative fucking energy when, when places have just gone positive? Aye, well done, man. Aye, well done, that's him. Man, aye, man, you're brilliant. Oh, oh, that, what do you, what do you mean? I've got my glasses. I've got glasses. No, I'm no bad, Ross, pal. Just pod on. That's just our son. Oh, got a new Celtic Viking. Oh, a wee Celtic boy in. Good boy. Like that, see the old, old, old Green Brigade coming in there. So, Celtic Viking, what? Well, where are you fair, buddy? Are you fair, Scotland? Are you fair, the bar? My family's with Cork and Donegal. Oh, 
But you talk and you're fucking at it. And because you could lie. What do you lie about? Go tell me. Hey, that's, that's answer, right? What do you lie about? Tell me what I lie about. What do you country to lie about? For Glasgow. That's going to be a place here, bro. And I will do a uh, fellow Glasgow man, a uh, Celtic boy. Thanks a lot for that. I'm just going to, that's police off gear. I want to answer my fucking question. And so, what do I constantly lie about? Right, brother, see you later. Figure that. And I'll say, um, see, you can't even answer me. I gave Dorkness Bar a fucking belt, blah, blah, blah. blah. Not the neck. Not the neck. Just don't tell fucking lies. You're the one that's lying. And you know what I mean? Don't need to be my show. He was a fucking bastard name. Remember that? Can you feel the point at all, Ross? Um, as I say, fucking, so then you start your pitch saying, I give you this. No, no, no. As I say, my ex partner was winding the sink, shut up between me and Jokney. Jokney went his own way. And I'll say, but I talked to Joe and they bought up, so away you go, brother. And no, it's <coughs> I'm short sighted and long sighted, you know what I mean? Um, so that's how and I'm kind of straining myself to look at the comments, eh? I can't really read small writing, so I probably do uh, need glasses. Oh, aye, man. Aye, aye, man. A lot of good... Uh, listen, Glasgow's for, Glasgow, that's full, a lot, Glasgow is full of a lot of good people. I've got a lot of good pals in Glasgow. And, um, and as I say, they're all brand new. And... Um, it's just every, everywhere you go, they're always a dickhead. Right? They're always a dickhead. Or they're always a knocking, you know what I mean? They're always an arsehole and a dickhead. And every time you go to or every city you move into, right? And, but I, Glasgow, I mean, there's, there's Tim Royston and that. I've got a lot of pals in Royston. Um, Parkhead. Um, and kind of shelters in there. You know what I mean? That's got a lot of people. Uh, that I know that stayed in that way, and uh, but I uh, Glasgow is a good place. It is a good place, and but as I say, it's just some of the people that stay in the place. It's just like Polka, and Polka is a good wee place. Right to people that stay here, it's not been brought up here. They come through. Oh, it's a good wee place, and that. But then they realise it's fucking shit, and ah, of course they are, man. Of course they are. I mean, and, but. You just, you just learn to deal with them, you know what I mean? You just keep yourself yourself and just go in it. And you just kind of, you know what I mean? Treat yourself normal and involved with the kid on the end. You just stay out the politics and just go in your life. Because at the end of the day, life's not about arguing with people, you know what I mean? And calling people. But see, see, see that advert that's on the telly, right? And it's about that lassie, right? And she's a drug dealer. And she's sitting there, right? And it's all oh, but don't judge me, blah blah blah, right? How is people meant it, right? So you people come on here, right? And you people come on other channels, right? And they're trying to deal with that and deal with that. So how 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 can I change my life around, right? And I've got people coming on constantly to try and bring me down, right? I'm lucky I'm thick skinned and just let it go me. But if I was that way. I could, I could go away and like, commit suicide day in and just with all this trolling and calling me this and calling me that, you know what I mean? And judging me. None of you know me, you know what I mean? None of you know me, you know what I mean? But you're judging me for what? What are you judging me for? You know what I'm talking about? That's what I didn't understand, is why why are you judging me when you've never met me? You know what I mean? But these are all 
supporting these messages and supporting this message, supporting that message, but you're and on the second hand, you're you're doing no protect. You know, I mean, you're, you're actually criticising yourselves, in. that's what I feel like, eh? right? Because none of you know, all you that flung hate towards me, no, no more loyal people, all the people that flung hate towards me, why do you do that? You know, I mean, because none of you know me. You know, what I mean, not why you walking, know me. And if you did know me, then you'd know, know you do that, because right? you wouldn't date my, to my fucking face, right? So, why do it ever telling? And, you know, you know what I mean? It's just stupid, you know what I mean? Because you know what I mean? I can't yourself. Because you know it's never going to happen. You're never going to do that. You're not going to do that. You know what I mean? You're not going to do nothing. You know what I mean? So, you'll sit on a fucking laptop. But, 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 in, right? But here we go again. Down G's hairline. Stutter that. Stupid. Again, stupid. Right. Dickhead. Right, you've got a picture of Dan G, right? We stutter that against you, but right. One, go and put your own face up. Two, right? Put your own name up. And three, we'll meet you. Then we'll see if you're still saying what you're fucking saying. See, this is what I'm saying. You've always got an idiot with us in your fucking street. And as I say, this is who it is. It is there. There's the banger there, eh? There's the banger there, right? There's the, there's the, there's the fucking village of the issue, eh? Eh? Now he'll, he'll be sitting there with his fucking hard on for two minutes, eh? Oh, you've got gas in this now. Right, but you'll know, you know say it to me. You fucking muppet, eh? So, go away and take your stutter before I'm looking at your fucking stagger. Right? You're a silly wee boy. Seeing as you may be. Wait, see, see, here we go, here we go. This is, I know, it's a sweet crack, right? Seeing as you may be, Tom. Where the fuck did I meet be, Tom? Maybe, right? If I met be, Tom, right? You fucking know about it. So would he, right? I went through the a fucking bathroom meeting. With somebody on a bike ride, okay? Not any day with me, Tom. I'm not interested in me, Tom. Or anybody, so still try to cause trouble. I step, and what about it? And what about it? And what about it? You know, and what a fucking about it? What about it? And what about it? And what, you know, and what? And what? And what? No, they fucking nothing. Right, then he's all day fucking in, right? So shut the fuck up, right? That was last year, this is this year, right? I was talking about it, they bother me, and but get a bath, you know, and what? There's no way to stop lying, lying about that, lying about that, mate, but you know, and, I know, I know, I know, Stephen Andrews, he's a fucking idiot, and he's a fucking idiot, this cunt, and he's just causing trouble, and lying about what? Phone down, gee, what am I fucking lying about? I know, and I know, I'm all mate, I mean, he's just a fucking clown, I'm just going to have a walk on, man, and I'm talking about, but this is what I'm saying, you know what I mean? You get idiots like this, you know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean? Fucking banger, you know what I'm talking about? And sorry about that, guys, eh? Sorry about that, and but fucking sick it every fucking time, and you know what I'm talking about. You come on, you got the next man, you get polluted, boy, has fucking trolls fucking trying to get tight. You know what I mean? For what? Didn't even know me, and never met me. I went through to Mary Hall, see a guy about a bike ride. Next man at fucking Boston, he was running about telling Mary Hall taxis, and showing them my, showing them my radio plate, and my car, put it on, put fucking, put it on YouTube. My wife's fucking car, and we're ready for it. And put it on YouTube. You know what I mean? That was last year. I mean, I've seen now he's back. You know what I mean? You just, you, 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 and that's it. That's how you know. 
that the Lord of Hearts and could see anybody that has got a heart and want or, 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 or saying they're going to do this and going to do that, they'd come to your door. If he said he knows my address and he does this and he does that, come to my door then. But the fact is, you can't. And you've not got a buzz in your heart. And, and this is 2022. Get a bye. I'm 40 year old. And so, you don't want to harm. You don't want to try to get clickbait, pal. And so, get a bye. This is the last I'm talking about you. You stop it. And because you don't want to make anything worse for yourself. And so, just stop it. And anyway. That's all day out and about. But look, man, and you see me done it. And all day, day you're fucking, you done, man, because, I mean, they've not got a boss, they've not got a boss to put a face to their fucking name. And I'm talking about. Look, there's a helicopter, look. Ah, yes, sir. Ah, yes, sir, my back door. This is my back door, by the way. And this is an HP cupboard. You know what I mean? It's a six foot to four foot space here. You know what I mean? Nice wee studio, nice and comfy and hot. The back door's there. That's a big cupboard, then walk-in cupboard there. And that's where uh, Curti makes her wax melts. Um, so, aye, man. And I'm happy. I'm getting on. As I say, I didn't look for hundreds of subs. I'm no chasing subs. I'm no chasing fucking all that. See, the end of the day, I'm only here to speak to people about mental health. I mean, if I can make you smile, then that's me, I'm happy. And so try and smile. Don't smile for me. See, I smiled and already I feel happy. And you smile. And tell them, I would honestly, everybody, right? Tell me you're watching, right? Smile at yourself, right? And comment and tell me if you feel better. And I guarantee you will. Okay? No, the good man, Kevin Lane. Um, a light hat man from London when I done the pod with him it told me to smile to smile because it makes you happy and ignore the haters and just smile big shout out to Kevin Lane for that good advice and that's that Celtic man a wee tick bra. Smile. And so we're going to school of the day, my man. Top class, eh? Top class. <laughs> my head. Right. My head. So, Paul McDuff is out and brother. Another one in. For you, my man. Paul McDuff. Where are you flying in from? They're all coming in tonight, brothers. Proudies, proudies. Love to all. Respect. Respect, respect, respect. Look to the good people of Scotland. So anyway, troops, we need to go up to the night. Think easy. Work tomorrow. Mind relaxing, chilling out. It's a good life. It's a good life, eh? I'd rather have this life and I'm fucking looked up. Glasgow, mate. And I'm Glasgow feeling. Good boy. Very you feeling, Glasgow, big man? I'm a Falkirk. I know you are. You're a living legend from Falkirk. Out and about and back. You're a legend from Falkirk, my hometown. What are you up to? You watching the soaps? What every other? Oh, Celtic will go up there. And are you watching the soaps like any other folk civilian out and about? But I had a say, eh? Bottom set, done the day, we've got the top set there. So, can't wait to get the bottom set in, and the top set in, and I'll have a wonderful white smile. And it took a wee bit of, took a wee bit of time, for the simple fact is, I had 
to be with the COVID and because I've got a broken jaw, I'd to get the angle correct. But in the next two to three weeks, I should have a full rack of fucking teeth. And so I'll be walking about with Sherga, the horse. So sorry, Maggie Thatcher. I already didn't kidnap fucking bastard Sherga. I did. So take that and fucking smoke it. And, um, but there's a lot of sad news coming out of Glasgow in the new Now, like, the serious note, hey, there's a lot of glass, there's a lot of sad news coming out of Glasgow. Um, and you just, it's just sad, eh? And what's that? Watching the Celtic game, mate, it's just started. I know I'm going to be off the screen in about the next five, ten minutes because I want to watch it because it's coming up an hour and drop me sparrows on, so this will be his hour. Um, too many people coming on the new man. We need to start fucking my pod at fucking half six. And, um, but I'm going to need to go on, try and get drunk and spar on, because I guess. Right? Um, you got to be bugged on, see what he's up to. And, eh, what do you think, guys? And, get drunk and spar on, got to laugh him. Drunk and spar right, like, and, um, what do you think, so what do you think, Donnie? You think Donnie's going to do Pablo? I think he will. If he sticks in with Stuart and James, Stuart and James will fucking train me Donnie up to punch it right up him. Easy. It's up to the bald and the Donnie's hand now. They stick up the training and the regime. Because I know, I know Stuart was sparring all day and fucking Donnie was sparring them. And they were had a good respawn session, so that's good to see. And I hope your your dad's doing well, Donny boy. But aye, as I say, lads, girls, never on. Aye, definitely, my wee silly boy. We we took guy, eh? Aye. Hope it does, eh? Cause see, in the day, I didn't mean any. I know it's all fun and games and that, right? And it's all done for banter, right? But seeing it comes to it, seeing it comes to like a sport, eh? Everybody gets rolled up, man. I love watching boxing, eh? As I say, seeing you were in the jail and used to watch boxing, fucking right, man. You know what I just the atmosphere is amazing, unreal, unreal atmosphere. But as I say, I. But you've got to remember, fighting trolls is other bit of experience in the ring, eh? You know what I'm talking about? And he's a big fucking lumpy laddie, Paul, like. Paul is a big boy, and he's no, he's no, um, a wee laddie. He's a big lumpy laddie, Paul, eh? And so, it's going to be a good thing, and it's going to be a good thing. Well, that's it, my man. Thanks for that. I mean, see if I can make anybody laugh and smile in the moment. You fucking laugh at me, or whatever. I'm going to go fuck. And if I make you laugh and smile, Every day, and or even whatever, sitting over laughing, I don't care. That's my bastard talking again. And I'm no bothering. And I'm here to help people with mental health issues. And as I say, homeless. And that's what I'm here for. You know what I'm talking about? And ex prisoners, justice for ex prisoners. That's it. And I'm not here to fucking open food banks. I'm not here to do this. I'm not here to do anything like that. I'm only here to cover the three angles that. I think Scotland needs is homeless, um, youth, more help with youth, sorry, and a lot more. Um, that's it, sorry, that's it, mind you, I'm blind now. A lot more educational things for the youth, the homeless, but i.e. and where to go for food and try and get some like just food, I just food to them a wee place where they can go and get their breakfast in um, and thirdly the corruption and the uh, injustice mis- justice, injustice men uh, prisoners 
Because as I say, there's another young boy at Pullman uh, committed suicide and New ball point dog man. Hook hook. Right, I'm going to go, lads. Game's started. Right, trip. Thanks for watching me tonight. Um, we're back on live on Wednesday. So, all, your, all the new members now, let's come on. Thanks for your blessings. Thanks for your uh, time to watch, sorry. And, um, all your comments and stuff like that are well, well, well appreciated and your support. So please keep following me. Please like, subscribe, um, and let's make this channel better. I'm only going, I'm only going to get better. Um, I've got my good man, um, Stuart Dempsey, James, uh, James Mitchell, and as I say, Johnny Boy Steel, keep me in, keep me in uh, check. So as I say, and we've got new content coming in and stuff like that. So please bear with me. We're getting there. The year twenty twenty two is coming with new stuff. I don't lie. As I say, I do see, I do see things, but it takes me a while to get there because I've got other things committed to, but. I, I took too much on last year, so I'm not going to lie about that. I took too much on last year, and I ran myself into the ground. So this year, I'm just starting off with just prisoners, justice for prisoners, justice, uh, justice for prisoners, trying to feed the homeless, and, and as I say, uh, help you away from drugs, crime, and please change your life and drop a knife. So please share like and subscribe to Carson TV as we're only on it better and I'm going to set a teeth shortly so over now bye bye